everyone here here. Just cause three now, this is one of the fails video that what I was aiming for didn't work. Now whether it was me against my wrong I, I can see where there's maybe a couple of mistakes. Or I was just the game doesn't allow this, which I find that very odd because there's very little that just cause doesn't allow the fantastic title it is. This is called Plane Train. It's kind of following on from some of the tether things we do, some of the various tether challenges. But basically, my logic was see if I could attach the train to a plane and take off with it. Now, I'm trying here with a helicopter first, just because I felt a helicopter would be easier. Easier to control, easier to get the initial tether with. So this is like proof of concept, basically. Also, I can't be bothered getting a plane and trying to land it somewhere near the tracks where I knew the train will eventually just deliver me one anyway. So it was worth hanging around. So you gain the train, once they start spawning, they know that, ah, there's one. So now I just need to derail it. Hopefully without destroying the bridge right now. Yeah, that did it. Although I didn't quite want that bit to go all the way over there. Plane pipes. Now I'm trying to position just over this. See tethers here. Luckily I've unlocked one of the first gear mods, so I know it does have four tethers to play with. This does make things a whole lot easier. I do I will need to do some more with unlock the six and also unlock the strength too, because I know that'll help a lot of the challenges a lot. There we go, those four tethers to make. Quite simple. Can I take off? <laughs> now I know the tethers are strong enough to pull the train carriage. Oh, they have moved it. I'm struggling to get lift, but I've definitely managed to move it around. Well, this, this isn't good. Got the trees. <laughs> Maybe this helicopter isn't powerful enough. Maybe I need to go and find. I'm slowly working through the unlocks on this game. Unfortunately, I keep. I set off to do the missions, see something interesting, and end up just following those. Well, I've moved it right across to the track now. Well, no, that's not good. Helicopters do not work as lawnmowers. Well, I guess they do, but it's rather expensive and rather damaging. I think all four tethers are still attached, which is quite impressive. Oh, shh. Sugar. That's not. Oh, no, it's shooting. And that's the end of that attempt. <laughs> now, of all the ways I expected, so I'm back, I've got another helicopter, so I've got to Whoa! I may have damaged the bridge. Enemy jet destroyed. Damn, I was hoping to. Yeah. I've got some carriages to play with. So let's see where we are. Gotta watch those SAM sites. Those can be the issue. So we have a flat rail can. Now this hopefully will be lighter than the SAM, so I may have a better time of trying to lift this up. <laughs> That's my theory anyway, just watch it now. Totally disproven. Also, trying to sort of stagger, trying to put them in really space like the back leg up to the back of the carriage just so it'll lift evenly. I don't know whether the game physics are clever enough for that to make a difference or not. But you see, they're all far tethered in place. Now we start pulling. And once again, he's just trying to drive me to the ground. Man, those convoys, it's funny how they're always driving just around me. Don't think it's gonna... Sideways. Oh, we're chopping down trees. Come on. Keep pulling. Yeah, I keep meaning to do the missions and then I will get round them. I just get easily distracted. 
suddenly see something interesting like, ooh, what's that? And next thing it's two hours later and you've done absolutely nothing productive. It's a fantastic feature, it's a fantastic bit of any open world game and the amount this game has that you can do is just unbelievable. Uh oh, Fred, Fred. I broke the tether that time, I wasn't doing that. Whoa! Bye! So I've got an empty flat bed here. Oh, that was the wrong button. So yeah, so I called in some assistance. There we are. Unfortunately, the trains weren't giving me one themselves, so I had to use one of my own. Something else needs to <laughs> Another train just piles off the edge. <laughs> Pipes. Got to wonder what Duravello is at. It only seems to be falling on these missiles, pipes, and army vehicles. That's the most random sort of fall. It don't empty contain containers, which I'm assuming contain military. So it's such random things to put together. It's like we're doing some kind of um, secret mine, secret oil drilling operation, where we know that substance in this isn't oil, it's that ravian. It appears to be some kind of mineral. Yeah, I'm trying to back, trying to back the plane's position near the plane. I was trying to make sure I was out of the way of the train. Not that way, really, just a bit of 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 Attached. I've attached the tethers to the jet. Oh, this is where I say I may not do it. Right. I don't know if the helicopter will block it. I've got the jet full power there, and it just will not, will not pull it forward. So I'm thinking either this won't work. The train carriages are just too heavy, too much mass for the game to do it. It's actually, I find odd when you consider that they'll lift. Uh oh. Well, hey! I find that only because the tethers can move them. And it's some movement, like I said, I think it's trapped under the helicopter. I mean, obviously, the, the trick to try would be to fly over and pick a carriage up, but by God, I don't think I would be able to line that up. This is not going to Oh well, the helicopter's not going to do anything. Oh, carriage skidding out the side. <laughs> Another machine going on the bottom there. And I blew myself up because I thought the missile would clear that carriage. Anyway folks, that's the video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Till next time, we'll see ya. Goodbye.